Farmers at Dunga Beach in Lake Victoria are counting losses worth millions of shillings following massive fish deaths in the area. The mysterious deaths were first reported on Wednesday and has affected over 30 cages, leaving hundreds of farmers who had invested heavily in the business with huge losses. Bramwell Buire reports. <laughs> For the second season running, a number of cage fishermen in Lake Victoria are counting huge losses following mysterious fish deaths. This time round, the deaths are affecting fishermen operating at Dunga Beach in Kisumo. At first, they thought the deaths were occasioned by strong waves. But as time went by, the numbers increased due to what the Director General Kenya Marine and Fisheries Research Institute, James Njiru, called low levels of oxygen in the lake. In the oxygens you are below uh, probably to the levels of two milligrams per liter, which is not conducive for the fish. Again, our sample results showed that there was a lot of algae uh, in the water, green algae or blue-green algae. And what happens when there's a lot of algae, as algae dies, uh, it uh, consumes oxygen in depth. Uh, so the, the algae consumed there around the cages and uh, the oxygen was not enough for the, uh, for the fish, probably causing that fish kills. Njiru, however, laid the blame to Dunga Beach cage fishermen, accusing them of ignoring laid down measurements. We recommend um, cages to be put uh, for the small cage farmers around uh, 6 meters uh, to 10 meters, but the cages at Dunga were around 4 meters, leaving only a depth between the cage bottom and the, um, and the, uh, the lake bottom, about 0 0.6 meters, which was not very good for secretion of, uh, of, of, uh, of water. Omondi Otieno, who is a cage farmer here, says at least 25 cages have been affected with the losses, estimated at more than 25 million shillings. He, however, wants the county government to set up an emergency fund kitty that will help them when they incur such heavy losses. Almost 25 cages in Mekufa, that approximately can amount over 25 million. Yeah, because each cage, each cage, if I give it a piece of 200 shillings, over 200, 250, let's give it a minimum of 250 shillings each. With uh, 5,000, that is almost over 1 million each. So it is almost approximately over 25 million. Yes. If the county government, for example, of Kisumu, should uh, put in place, uh, I mean, the finance that can help farmers once they have gone, uh, the, once they have experienced such a disaster, there's already a uh, fund be uh, put in place that can help us out very fast. The deaths are coming barely a week after Kisumu Governor Professor Nyang Nyongo commenced the distribution of fingerling to the previously affected cage fishermen at Ogal Beach. Bramwell Bire, Kete News, Kisumu. Conservation efforts 